Hey, what's going on everybody? Analogy bringing you another arena gameplay. Unfortunately, I was unable to get good sound quality. I live calmed this with some buddies, uh, but I was unable to get good quality, so I figured let me just do a, a voiceover on this uh, and, and kind of save everybody the hassle of listening to that god-awful echoing and music in the background kind of stuff. It was, it was terrible, but... Anyway, um, I must admit, I really wasn't ready for the start of this match. And, uh, Not really sure why I picked the sniper. They banned the thermal, which is why I had to go with a different scope. Um, but I, I really did not help my team at all this first round. Now you'll see towards the end I kind of pick it up a little bit. But at this point, I'm just trying to get in the right position. We're spread out pretty well over the A-bomb. Obviously, the A-bomb is down. And I'm just trying to kind of support my teammates. I see... My one teammate gets picked up here, and uh, I thought for sure he was going to be pushing through. He had a shotgun, so I thought he would at least stay in there and try to pick up another kill because just naturally you would think that, okay, I pick up a kill, and they're probably going to try to rush me, at least you know from an amateur standpoint. Obviously, the professionals would be a little bit a little bit more uh, professional, I guess. I, didn't, I couldn't really think of a good word. So anyway, we get, we get round one. Uh, going into round two, I switch over to the XR2 with uh, Long Barrel Quick Draw and the ELO side. I thought this was a, a great class. I always do great with this on Hunted. So, luckily, I'm sitting back. I figured if I'm playing AR, I'm going to try to play more of a support, support role. Uh, and luckily, me sitting back, I was able to pick up the guy on the wall run. And then they called, they called that mid uh, push right there. And I was able to pick that up. So, now it's a 2v1. Probably not the best route for me to take. On a 2v1, when you're spread out like this, it really gives the opposition an opportunity to clutch this up. So if we are together, we should be playing for trades because obviously we have the man advantage. So if him and I are running together and I maybe see him walk around a corner or he sees somebody walk around a corner and gets picked up, then I'm able to find out, you know, get his location or able to trade the, able to trade the kill. Um, so he, he does in fact pick up my teammate and I, I did get lucky here. I, I kind of fired a little too soon and luckily he wasn't able to, to pick up that kill. So, um, we take two rounds to none. I think some of these guys didn't have thumbs, but regardless, uh, we pick it up and uh, I hear the wall run right here and I kind of just hop up and pick up that kill. So now it's a 4v2. And then I believe my teammate gets one here, oh, traded out, and then I figured we're all kind of pushing the B bomb. They got to be looking for flank. If I'm playing the AR role, I'm sitting back. If I rush with this gun, I'm probably not going to do too well. So you see me kind of take the same route here. I'll, I'll go like the, the the cave route, and then if somebody or my teammate wants to push through there, then I'll kind of back up. So I'm really kind of just watching flank. I, I peek the bomb there. I see somebody's on bomb, and I didn't know if he was head glitching or he was actually planting. That's why I kind of hesitated getting back but my teammate I called it out my teammates able to pick that up so now it's a, again it's a 2v1 I'm a little closer he calls this out and I'm surprised that the teammate or not my teammate but their their teammate uh, didn't move that was kind of ballsy on their end to kind of sit there he just picked up the kill picked up that kill in the same spot but never really moved so it was really an easy kill for me I thought he was going to jump up but he never did so I pick up the kill now we're kind of starting to run away with this I'm on a pretty decent streak and uh, I believe, I forget what it said, but we're 4-0. Not too much to worry about at this point. So you see I have my dart and a counter UAV. I'm going to throw up the counter UAV, and I'll fast forward this part a little bit. But um, I'm, not, I'm not really a fan of the dart. It's kind of, uh, it's a little sketchy for me. It's kind of hard to control, I think. Um, and, you know, not really using it ever. I'm, I'm, I'm really just looking to, to use it for callouts. But I'm able to pick up two kills there. I'm happy with that. Uh, but, but three of our teammates go down, so now it's a 2v1. I'm stuck in my base. I get one shot right there. Actually, I'm, I'm pretty close to dying. I figured he's going to try and rush me, so I hop back. My teammate called out that the, the person that I, you didn't see that was uh, that was kind of pushing me there was uh, had a sniper. So I'm like, all right, I think my chances are pretty good. As long as I keep my distance and keep moving, uh, then I, I should be okay. So... I plant the bomb here. I thought for sure he was going to come from water and kind of pretty much just jump right on top of me and kill me. Uh, so as I push out through here, my teammate says, I think I heard him wall run. So I kind of just hightail it back. And I see him laying there. Luckily, he misses the sniper shot. And I slide in with active camo. He has rejack, but he doesn't end up using it. So we go up five rounds to none. 
obviously feeling pretty good at this point. Uh, so I'm going to check this this lane here uh, with the XR2. My aim was was pretty good tonight, or the night that I recorded this. It's not tonight, um, but I was able to uh, to keep my aim uh, pretty pretty legit. So. Um, I'm just kind of again. I'm I'm playing the same role on on each side. I'm just kind of a support role, just kind of like anchoring the back, I guess. Uh, so it's a two v four at this point, and then I believe we trade these out. So I'm really kind of looking for a one v three clutch. If it's a one v two, I think it's doable. But yeah, it goes to a one v three. They have bomb down, so I'm I'm looking at like thirty five seconds to to make a move. And luckily, there's not like. There's a lot of open space, so like for somebody to really sit in the corner is kind of dumb, but I'm able to get the melee, the uh, little bow to the backside there. Um, they call out uh, the water, then he shoots me, and he's he's sitting in plant, and I actually watched his kill cam, and it was pretty pretty funny. Uh, I thought I had him. I thought, I, I thought my aim was a little bit better than what was shown, but regardless, they pick me up, and that's actually my first death of the round. And now I believe I am 11 and 1 at that point. So moving into round, I guess that would be 7. Yeah, I'm 11 and 1. Everyone else is kind of like 6 and 4, or 5 and 4, or whatever. I have another dart and a counter UAV. So I'm going to push through with the te my teammates. And I called out since I have, again, the XR2, I'm, I'm kind of long range. I'm going to call out this like top dom rock area. As they push through, they wanted to push A, and I, I get the hit marker. I'm, I'm unable to pick him up. So, and I, I probably shouldn't have pushed like rotated back here. I should have I should have pushed up with my teammate, and I get stuck on that trash can. I'm like, oh, I don't want to rush, and then and then unfortunately there's two guys there, and they pick me up. Um, but we're able to get the the final kill. My buddy here, Aladdin, is able to kind of run out and and pick up the kill. He has a high sensitivity. I'm surprised he he was able to pick that up, but regardless, he does. And, uh, and that is the game. So 6-1 uh, round victory. And uh, we're able to pick up this, this arena S&D. Uh, a little bit of a weird commentary today. But uh, I'm hoping to kind of produce more of these in the future. So uh, if you guys like it, please like, subscribe, comment, do all that cool stuff. I'd be really interested to hear from you. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks.